All right. How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? We're here today to do Aston and Joe 2, episode 29, live reaction. So, obviously, you find a link in the description down below for Amazon Drive. Um, I, if you guys haven't watched the last video, basically, for like over the course of this week, I'm going to do like five episodes to each show. At least that's the plan. We all, we all know how I am with plans, but that's the plan. Five episodes for each show. Um, just because obviously university starts again for me next week, so starting next week there'll be a lot less episodes, uh, maybe just like an episode or so a week, or maybe and when an episode or two a week. We'll see how it's yeah, obviously how it goes with it being the final year and obviously the first week of university. Usually the first weeks are pretty pretty stressful, but like I said, we'll see. So that's why I'm gonna, I'm trying to do five episodes a uh, five episodes over this week over the course of this weekend. So yeah, as always, you find a link in the description down below for. Amazon traffic and watch it that way. But we're gonna get started in three, two, one, go. I guess in, I don't know what I like. Like I like don't get me wrong, I like this in, I like the music of this intro. I just don't think it should be an opening. Like, like you know, you have the previous openings. Uh, let me just put it off so I don't think of like the previous, so, so I can actually think of the previous opening. You have the previous opening which starts with dum dum da like, well Doo -doo -doo. Oh, that's that's a that's a terrible impression. But you know, it it, it starts off straight away with like high action. Um, like so just to get straight into it. This one is just calm. Like like it, you almost wonder if the opening has actually started. That's what it feels like in my opinion. Just a totally different opening. I don't know. I, as a as a tune itself, I like it. I just don't know whether it should be an opening in all fairness. But oh well, oh well. Hey 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 blues, mm, rolling the blues. Bum bum bra. That's the one. I, I don't know. Is that my favorite? I think it's my favorite. I still think it's my favorite. The deepest voice I've ever heard. Should be Louis Armstrong. Legit, Louis Armstrong. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. Straight up. Not even a hint of a warning. Well, I, I think Joe was caught off guard. There's no way an eyes roll back. This guy has taken so much punishment. There is no way he'll be knocked out by one punch. It, got, it doesn't matter how strong this guy is. No way. One punch, no. Will he defend his title? Joe Yabuki. I don't think that's really much of a question. <laughs> if he were to lose his title right now, after all he's gone through against Kim. I'd be suing him. <laughs> that's thing I'd think about when I wake up. That's is his fist is his side swollen. I don't know, okay, usually with boxing yards they have a glove as well, but so you Yeah, it's gonna make the rounds, of course. Wait, did I just say tomorrow's Joe? 
the newspaper, Astronaut Joe. Tomorrow's Joe. I think that newspaper says tomorrow's show. I don't know, this guy doesn't seem all that good. Number three boxer. I see. Seeing how tall he is, I can understand why. Isn't that damn face job? Wide swing and he goes for it, okay. Like a shark and blood. I mean look, Joe is taking it serious, don't get me wrong. He is fighting to his best. He's practicing to his best potential. What about your weight training? I mean, I don't think he's gained that much weight. So maybe it's not as much of an issue as it was previously. I don't know. This music fits so well with like the whole Hawaiian theme. Ah, uh, is Yoko going to be there as well? She watched just with that family, right? Is Yoko going to be there as well? Good. Good. Not in front of the children. Don't let him beat you a second time. <laughs> Is that really? Is that really that much of a surprise? I've got is it, is it what I think it might be? Ah, yeah. yeah, I, I don't know.
Okay. I don't think it would be a good in. It, yeah. You don't. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I will see guys, I, I think most people don't even care about the Yoko and Joe connection. I do. <laughs> uh, I care a lot about that. I just wish there was something. Just give me something. It's like every time there is a potential moment, they just take it away from me. Fight is happening much sooner than I expected. I mean, okay, it will be the same people. It will be the same people, I guess. Hey, Joe, get in there! <laughs> shame it's not Yoko. Or even Norik. <laughs> I don't feel like he's gonna lose now. And I just feel like, to be fair, it was a case of like that one battle he had as well, where he just beat the guy in like the first round, the Muay Thai champion or whatever it was. Like, I just feel like Joe is too focused on that instead of... F he has been for a while though, so I don't think he's going to lose just because of that now, but... I don't know. I don't know. It's going to act professional, of course. Yep. Yeah. That, that's what I mean, it's just such a polarizing opposite. One is calm and composed, the other one is just a raging animal. That's why you know, Joe is essentially just doing it for himself. Whereas he, with Mendoza, you can actually see that he's got a family and whatnot. He's got a tomorrow. <laughs> Despite the show obviously be called Joe's Tomorrow. Victory. Why not? This guy's too cocky, man. <laughs> the other guy didn't have any introduction whatsoever. No build up, so I can actually see that happening. I think he's just being far too cocky. If we were like, if we were to lose now, he's gonna leave a mark, isn't he? Forcing him to shake his hand or what? <laughs> <laughs> This guy is humiliating. Look at that! Yo, I, I, I'm done. 
not even gonna lie, I love the way they make the buildings up. Yeah, is he talking? Oh, this can't be good. Is he actually talking about waves or is he talking about like something like tinnitus? Because that sounds like static or waves. I feel like something's bad. It's gonna. I, I honestly do. There's just too much build up. Yeah, he's not your typical fighter. <laughs> Just like, yo, it stops. I knew this wasn't gonna go well. Joe has taken immense amount of punishment, though. This guy was about to go headbutt. That's a headbutt. You can't headbutt, can you? I don't know. <laughs> he's gonna get. Yeah, he's humiliating himself, predicting a KO victory. He looks pathetic, though. <laughs> to be totally honest. Don't tell me he's off balance or something. That like, that wave comment. Yeah. This wouldn't be as easy. Don't focus on that. He doesn't even look, he doesn't even care. Look at this guy. He's, he, you're a champion, Joe. Uh, this, this is not <laughs> what I think that's impossible. I think that is impossible. Nope, nope, nope. On the ropes, yeah. On the ropes, yes. Joe looks significantly weaker. I, I don't know. Is it just me? Like, I don't know how good this other guy is. Third, all right, but. Uh, you, you figure with the amount of. The amount of experience that Joe has, he wouldn't be getting destroyed like this. Or it's just because he's going for that KO. But he's been always been going for the KO. It's not just the first time he's gone for a KO or predicted predicted a KO. Nope. No. No, that's the whole point of being an outboxer. By the time Joe can strike, he'll be gone. Yeah. Yeah.
why are they throwing money? <laughs> why are they throwing? Yo, I'd be like, yo, I'd pick that up and I'd leave. <laughs> Is that a whiskey bottle? Who? That whole wave thing. Did that hit me? I don't, I don't know. I don't think that hit him in the ear. Like, obviously, where the ear is. Or is that still the reason why he's not really... Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe I spoke too soon. He is going for it. Okay. That, that was not a KO, never mind. An uppercut as well. Yeah, this guy is done for. <laughs> this guy. Ah, clinching. Nah, he's done for. He's out. Ref, 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 ref. Yeah. Night, night. Alright, Joe retains the title. He is still the OP BF champion. OPBF. I keep calling it OBPF. He's the only one he cares about is obviously I mean, he's not even wrong. Joe is rude. But that's what makes Joe Joe. <laughs> that's what makes Joe Joe. Not Joe Joe, but Joe Joe. <laughs> Hearing the waves in the background, I just I feel the worst for Joel. I really do. Looks like yeah, that's the end of the episode. Now, as someone, I mean, I wouldn't even call myself really suffering from tinnitus, but as someone that like I wouldn't call myself suffering from tinnitus. Uh, like there is a very slight ringing in like one of my ears, but you, I wouldn't even notice. It. I don't. You don't notice that unless it's like a hundred percent silent. So you know, I, it would be like the, the tiniest amount. Like you, you can't, you can't even hear it now. Even if I focus on it, I can't hear it. Like if only if it's like really, really quiet, I can actually hear like a slight ringing, like shh, like that. So somebody that, especially you know, when you get hit in the face and whatnot, I don't know how it is, but I'm pretty sure that if you get hit in the ear and whatnot. Uh, and I don't even know if I suffer from tinnitus. I don't know whether that's just me suffering from tinnitus or whether that's just my imagination. You know, that's like that's the kind of thing because it's so quiet that it's really difficult to uh, to uh, to know if it, if you're actually suffering from something or whether that's just your imagination. I guess you know. Um, but that whole ocean thing, that whole ocean, uh, I, you know, be quiet so I can hear the sound of the ocean. To me, 
I don't, I don't know if I should, how I should interpret that. Was that just as he talking about the oceans themselves, or is that supposed to be a hint at something? I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm just hoping for the best. Let's just hope for the best. Let's hope for the best. Let me stop being so negative. Let me stop being so pessimistic. Because quite frankly, um, quite frankly, like every time I feel like Joe, like for example, take the Kim fight for example, I thought that Joe might lose. Um, the only time I was right, you know, the only time I've been right so far when I said that Joe was gonna lose was Rikishi, <laughs> and technically he won in the end, uh, if you wanna put it that way. But like, 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 I don't know. I just feel I always feel the worst for Joe. I really, I always feel the worst for Joe. It was the same with uh, thing as well. What's his name? Uh, what's his name? I forgot his name right now. Uh, Not not Jose. Uh, da, 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 da. I can't believe I can't believe I forgot his name right now. Uh, the one guy, the one the one guy from yeah, that, that, it's that they mentioned last episode. Who obviously ran away? Uh, how, how do I not remember his name right now? Carlos, Carlos, that's the one. Carlos Rivera. Um. Yeah, like. like I always, feel, I always feel like Joe has no chance. He always proves me wrong, let's be totally honest. I mean, Carlos Rivera, I thought he had no chance at all. Then the Kim fight, I thought, you know, with the whole uh, him being a supercomputer and what he obviously went through, and then uh, Joe going through his weight, lost his weight thing, uh, I thought there's no way that Joe could win. And then he still is still one. So that's what I mean. Like, Joe is just... He just surprises me at all times. So maybe I'm just being too negative. So when I hear something along the lines of like, I can hear the waves. Maybe I'm just thinking of the worst. I'm usually a positive person, but I don't know. I don't know. I, I just, the, ever since that Rikishi thing, right? Ever since the Rikishi thing, even the wolf thing, but the Rikishi, it was mainly the Rikishi thing. I mean, the wolf thing, I looked at it, I was like, you know what? That was a, that was a quadro cross counter. A quadro cross counter. You ain't getting away from you ain't getting away from getting hit like that and then you're walking away scot free. But what what's the Rikishi thing? Ever since then it was really just like hey, yeah, okay. This anime, you know, anything can happen. Like it, the main character losing, that might happen. Or the main character or like well I, I can I consider I mean if you if you don't want to consider Rikishi a main character, I consider him the main character the same the same way I consider Dampe, the same way I consider Joe, the same way that I consider um Yoko, the, the same way I consider Nishi like a main character. I think those are like the main characters. Children, not quite. But like Yoko, Dampe, I thought Rikishi, you know, especially first season obviously. Uh Yoko, Rikishi, Dampe, Joe um, Nishia, those were the main characters. Everyone else was just either a secondary character or just a f your background character. But for me, like, like I said, I think considering that um, that like this show doesn't care. Like, it, I don't, well, that's probably the wrong way to put it. But it doesn't really pull its punch. Like main character Stein, it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't shy away from that. And um, I don't know. Maybe that's why I fear. Because usually, I usually. When I watch a show, I always feel like, oh yeah, main character, you know, he's not going to die, he's not going to get injured, he's not going to be hurt, you know, he's not going to uh, suffer a permanent injury. But with Joe, I just, I don't know, I've got a bad feel. I've just got a bad feeling. I don't know whether that's just because, I've, just because of what happened to Rikishi and I feel like, maybe, I don't, I don't think so. I think it would, it could only happen, like... Maybe, maybe I need to make a separate video on this, but I don't feel like that there's a point really making a separate video on this considering there's like 20 episodes left. But like, I don't know, let's, let's go on a little bit of a tantrum here. Let's just deviate a little bit and just I call it my post-match talks, post-match review, whatever. Uh, not post-match, but post-episode review. Um, with Ashton and Joe, I mean, obviously this has been, I guess, talked about a lot in the comment section recently not recently but more so back then when it was like Rikishi and uh, what's his name Carlos I keep forgetting his name Carlos you know there's a lot of talks of Joe either getting permanently injured because obviously that's what he's doing and then obviously his whole talk about the flame combustion and whatever um, that you know his flame sparks the brightest when he's in the ring and it's not one of those cheap flames it is a genuine flame um, is Joe gonna be seriously in? like? Maybe I should talk about this in the next episode because I think the whole wave thing that that that's 
for me that is i mean tinnitus people might not consider consider it that serious you know considering that you can get you know a lot worse can happen in boxing but i feel like something like that like a serious injury or something is going to happen to joe uh, no i don't know like if, the, if it was rikishi I, I could probably see it Right now, obviously, they're building up uh, Jose, so maybe by the time that fight happens, if it ever happens, I'll be like, you know what, uh, you know, there, there's something bad could happen. But right now, I just feel like Jose, he's just been there. You know, he's been in the background for quite a bit now, but he's not really been that much of a competitor slash rival besides being a champion to Joe. Um, so maybe, obviously, like I said, if they build it up where, where uh, Jose... He acts, you know, looks like a genuine threat on somebody that has maybe not perhaps history with Joe. But, you know, that there's just more of a rivalry, like a clash between them. Maybe then I can see something bad happening to Joe. But I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I'll just talk about hypotheticals here. Like, Nishi, I thought, he, I thought something was going to happen to him as well, you know, after the whole him eating thing. But then that was kind of ignored. So maybe I'm just maybe I'm reading too much into things. I mean, I always am. But I guess that's why <laughs> that's why like I've got so many different scenarios running in my head. But I don't know. Like, I don't know. Anyway, we'll see. I mean, I, ultimately there's like 20 episodes left. Uh, we'll see by the time I'm finished with the show. Maybe I was spot on with something. Maybe I was totally wrong and Joey just becomes an undefeated champion. I like that kid that we saw in like the last episode. Um get his name i don't know i don't know where he got his name but a kid that not last episode two episodes ago you know the biker kid maybe then we'll see joe be like a mentor to that guy and then like joe essentially become dampe and uh because Dampe did want to open like a massive gym so maybe joe will be like a coach or whatever a manager you know boxing coach and that would be, that would be, that would be pretty cool to see to be fair but i don't i don't know which how much joe could really teach because he's just like an instinct fighter I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, um, uh, anyway, I'll, I mean, he did kind of teach that kid. He did kind of, kind of you know, teach that kid, put your arms up a little bit, you know, focus on this, focus on that. So, ah, I don't know. I don't know. There's obviously still this thing with Wolf to be re resolved, him giving the money back. So, yeah, there's still a lot. There's a still a lot. Like, besides, obviously, the main title fight that I'm hoping is going to happen anytime soon. Let me, let me just be totally honest here. But besides that, there's still a lot that, that has to be resolved, I guess. So maybe I shouldn't speculate just yet because anything could change, you know. You know, we only got to introduce like Rikisha, like episode twelve, I think, of or episode thirteen, one, like one of these early episodes of Ashino Joe one. So I don't know, I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. Maybe Thing will come back, Carlos will come back, and my whole idea will change when it, by the time he comes back. Who knows? Uh, and regardless, I'm, this video has gone on for quite a long. I mean, this was like a ten minute discussion. Um, I mean, considering I just did discussion, let me just quickly say this as well. I'm actually planning on doing a few podcasts. Uh, I don't know just yet, like, how it's going to go. I mean, it's just an idea at this point, uh, me doing a podcast. Uh, but I was planning on doing, like, podcasts for each show that I'm, like, watching or whatever. Like, invite a few people. Uh, if, if a few of you guys would be interested, um, just join the Discord. Because <laughs> it's much easier to discuss things on Discord because with YouTube... Although I do check the comments, it's most of the time, most of the time when I check the comments, it's when I'm uploading. That's really when I'm on YouTube. So, you know, that, that, that's why when you see me respond to a comment, most of the time that's because I'm uploading right now. So I'm just like having a look through all the videos, the, all the recent videos. Um, whereas Discord, obviously, I'm pretty much in 90% of the day, I guess you could say. Uh, so, you know, if, you're not, if you would be interested, let me just say this. If, if you would be interested in joining like a, a disc uh, uh, a not perhaps not a podcast perhaps that's the wrong way to put it but if you would be interested in like joining like a show i guess you can you can call it if you want uh just you know join the discord and then just you know write me on there just write on there on a discord and i should definitely see that you know i check the discord pretty much once at least like once an hour <laughs> so yeah that's all there is to it darling and gentlemen i like it i will see you guys next time like i said there's going to be like five episodes to each show during this weekend and i'll see you then peace out and have a nice day